Breaking news this morning, a Chicago police officer has been hit by a car in the South Loop. Glenn Marshall is there on the scene with the details. Glenn? Yeah, good morning, guys. Now, that officer is in fair condition at Northwestern Hospital right now after being hit by this Dodge Charger that you're seeing right here in the middle of the street. Police are still investigating this situation, but they did tell us this collision happened around 222 this morning here at the intersection of Ida B. Wells and Clark. Police are telling us an officer was directing traffic when a male driver of this Dodge Charger failed to stop hitting the officer. The driver of the Dodge Charger, along with a male passenger, were placed into custody. The officer was transported to Northwestern Hospital with nine life threatening injuries. Now we did speak to someone who said people were out still celebrating the Mexican Day Independence Day, I should say. He came out after he heard the crash. The police had kind of made it where it's like they was funneling everybody up out here like you, you couldn't go like up in the city nowhere. You had to come back out through here. I don't know exactly how this happened because it was saying like everybody like it was all over with like everything was over. And we are hearing that two guns were recovered inside that Dodge Charger, and this crash may just be alcohol-related. Of course, we'll keep you updated as we receive more information. But one thing to know that uh, that officer, I should say, was uh, transported to Northwestern Hospital in fair condition. Two people are in custody. Again, we'll keep you updated as we receive more information on this. But for now, we're live downtown. I'm Glenn Marshall, WGN News.